We're back. Welcome back to the second hour of Video Soul. I'm Donnie Simpson. Our special guest is the one and only Chucky Booker. <laughs> We're just talking about the groove, our theme song. Yeah. Good friends of yours. Tommy, Tommy. And Tommy. Yeah. What's up, dude? <laughs> Time. <laughs> uh, Foster McElroy. As a matter yeah. of fact, they, they have an album out, FM that uh, is so bad. Well, the latest single, Around the World in 80 Beats, Cold. is serious. Cold. These cats are bad. Where did all these young producers come from? I mean, you, them, Jimmy and Terry, L.A. and Face, Teddy. <laughs> all of a sudden, it's like all the young guys are making all the music that's happening. Yeah. I can't explain you it. Can't explain I can't it, explain it. It just happens. How come you don't have a partner, man? I it's not just, everyone else has a partner. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Who is it that you admire uh, as producer? Producers? Uh, Jimmy and Terry. Mm -hmm. uh, Stevie Wonder. Barry White. Uh, God, the list goes on. Mm -hmm. David Foster. It's countless. Yeah. I like anything that catches my ear. Uh-huh. Yeah. Uh, what is it that you like about Jimmy and Terry most? Man, they just, their style is so complex, but yet it's funky. Mm -hmm. You know, they have, I mean, it's very melodic, you know. Mm -hmm. Their melodies, uh, the sound is clean. I mean, they're, they're engineers. I mean, it's just, everything is polished, but yet it still has the grit. You know, it's funky. Mm -hmm. That's what I like about it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, when you listen to other songs, other artists, other producers, does that influence you at all in what you do in the studio? Um, in some ways, yes. I mean, it, it inspires me to write, but I don't necessarily like write off of what I hear. Yeah, right. Yeah, you know, but to some degree, it does inspire me. Yeah. yeah. But you know, you see a lot of uh, producers or artists that say, well, this groove is happening now. We got to do this. You know, because right. this is what's hot. Right. Um, do you do that, or do you no. just ignore what's... No. Just do what's in your heart? I just do what, what's there, you know, whatever was in my background, what I grew up with. I just take those elements and create to the best I can possibly do. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Now, Barry White is your godfather? My godfather. Is that right? Yeah. So, did you ever go on tour with him when... Yeah. Uh, did you really? A couple of shows, yeah. How old were you when you were out on the road with him? Well, 1920. Oh, okay. Yeah. So it wasn't that long ago. It wasn't that long ago. <laughs> <laughs> what was that like, though, to see Barry? I mean, here's your godfather on stage making all these women scream. <laughs> and how do you look at that and not want to go on stage and do the same thing? I don't know. It's, it's just a whole different vibe. It's a whole different trip, you know. You, know, you see him go up on stage and just go, uh, you know, and the whole <laughs> crowd is, ah, you know. It's crazy. And he does have that effect. I don't know. There aren't too many people like that. I mean, Barry could just come out and say, uh, Hello. Yeah, hello. <laughs> hello. And they just go nuts. <laughs> I mean, he's just got that powerful yeah. voice. There's no one like him. Yeah. It's really something. Anyway, we want to take a look at one of your videos now. This is Chucky Booker with Don't You Know I Love You on Video Soul. Video Soul, Don't You Know I Love You. Just jam it. We played Troop earlier, Spread My Wings, right. which looks like it's going to be a number one song in the country. And that's your song. Right. You wrote and produced it. Right. Um, how do you not keep a song like that for yourself? <laughs> well, actually, it was between that and Turned Away, which mm. was going to be on my first album, and I had to make a decision. And I didn't want to put, I didn't want to put both of them, yeah. you know, of them on the same album. So I just figured, well, Spread No... I'll put Turned Away on, now I'll save, spread my wings, and I wanted to give Troop something a little bit different, you know, for yeah. their second album, so I gave it to them, and plus, they're my, those are my boys. Yeah, right. Yeah. <laughs> Some of the boys. That's great. Well, they were on the show a couple of weeks ago, and they, they're real cool, man. Yeah. I really enjoyed them. But, uh, and Turned Away didn't do bad for you either, so, no. so it all works out, doesn't yeah. it? Plus, it's still yours. I mean, yeah. you know, someone else singing. Right. Well, I know you got to go. You must have to get some sleep. <laughs> because, I mean, I cannot believe you do what you do every night. How do you feel when you get through a Janet set? <laughs> I mean, do you, like, want to go to sleep, or are you so pumped up because it is a show? Well, I'm pumped up, but after a little while, you know, you get on that bus, and you're doing this for, like, the first 15 minutes, and you have to go to sleep. You yeah. Know? Uh -huh. 
I just cannot imagine doing the opening act and then coming out and performing for another 90 minutes with Janet. Yeah. But y'all are having fun, aren't you? We have you? a lot of fun. Yeah. A lot of fun. Okay. Well, thanks so much for joining us, Chuck. It's great to be here. All right, real pleasure. Chucky Booker, our guest today on Video Soul. Check him out. He's part of the Rhythm Nation tour again. He's the opening act, and he also performs with Janet as a musical director. We'll be back in a couple of minutes with more Video Soul. Don't go away. It's...